Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and children of all ages. What would that be, children of all ages? Zero to a hundred. Zero to a hundred is still a child? Hey, if uh, they feel like a child in their heart, they're a child. Just do it. If you say so. I'm a child. I'm, I'd I, say... I, I don't think... I, I don't feel like a child. Oh, I don't feel like a child. I feel... But in my mind, <laughs> I'm only five. Yeah, so. well, I can attest to that. <laughs> anyway, guys, we are on our way. Guess where? To the doctor's at the hospital for another test and still not getting crap. <laughs> so, my blood pressure this morning was 208. 208, I thought it was 212. Something like that. Over 103, I think it was. A million. I don't know, but it's still not going down. I'm on this medication, and there was a whole mix-up on this medication, and I am pretty sure that we stopped it because of migraines, because it was on my allergy list, but people said it shouldn't have been on my allergy list because we didn't stop taking it for that. We just lost track of it in the midst of all my prescriptions, but I think it was on our, my allergy list for a reason. So, right now we're heading to the doctor's just to do a blood pressure check. I have my cuff with me, so we can make sure that it's working right. Whee! I don't know why he's weeing, because this is not fun for me. <laughs> Get off your roller coaster, mister, and join me, will you? <laughs> Alright, guys. <laughs> we will see you in a little while. Bye. Hello. We stopped by McDonald's to get something to eat, and our little friend over here, French Fry, always comes to visit us. Yes, I named him French Fry. He only visits us because you feed him. Shh! I was told not to. Oh, no, everybody, especially from Megan. Mm hmm. Well, we uh, got your blood pressure checked three or four times. Mm hmm and it was high every time. This is what they were. I'm gonna just tell you, because you can't really see that. 192 over 94, 190 over 92, 188 over 90. And my, my blood pressure cuff, they checked it, and it's those lowers those numbers are coming out lower yes lower so my blood pressure blah, my blood pressure cuff is giving me low readings so on those times that i had over 200 <laughs> it was low for my blood pressure my cuff I don't know what I'm trying to say. Well, but I'm pointing at you the entire time, so. Well, good because you know, no one wants to point at you. So we ordered another, uh, another one. Blood pressure cuff. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. Blood pressure cuff. Cuff or cuff? Cuff. 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 It's not a cup. It's a cuff. Mm -hmm. All right. Could have gotten a blood pressure wrist thing. <laughs> but it doesn't sound very good. As you guys can see, it's a nice, beautiful, overcast, warmish for everybody else. No, coldish for everybody else. Yes. But no, you have the air conditioner on. Mm-hmm. Oh my. I got one of those people that are is, uh, riding my f fender and he's not going to like it when I go to speed him in here. Okay guys, we'll catch you at home. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm filming and nibbling with the neighbors. Is this a nibbling with the neighbors? <laughs> it's just a video. I yeah, don't know where it <laughs> um, I bought, We're making stuff, well, we're making cabbage boats. 
it's a little easier than stuffed cabbage. And um, it's something I just came up with because I was too lazy to try and wrap them. So I started with cabbage boats. So my cabbages are really cooked and... Overcooked? Uh, not overcooked. I should, I could make it better if I just kind of waited for it to cool off just a little bit. But, but this is what I do. Instead of putting the fixture in, rolling it, and cooking it in the oven, I, I mean kicking it in a pot on the stove, I do this. i um, finish mixing up the, the innards. I'll put them on it, put a little bit of sauce on it, and put it in the oven and cook it that way. Um, I know it's not the way my mother did it, so if my sister or my nieces are watching, I know it's not the way mom did it, but it doesn't mean I can't do it this way. So, um, the cabbage is done, the rice is done, I gotta put the rice in here and mix it up, and... Oh, cabbage breath. Hey going to be worse in a little while. <laughs> it's not going to be breath. <laughs> mm, very nice, dear. It's a good thing you have your own bathroom. Yeah, but who uses it all the time? <laughs> That's because mom has her own bathroom. <laughs> That's right. And, and no one can be in it. <laughs> I'm going to do a little double on some of this cabbage so it's a little bit it might be a little harder the further down you go oh it, it will be I'm, so I'm trying to you see I'm just picking some of it off um, should we cut it or something no because if you cut it you're not going to get the big pieces you got the dog's attention that's for sure yeah, I'm going to let that cool a little bit. Drop something on the floor. Meanwhile, I'm going to take this. See how my rice is. Uh-huh. And if it's good to go, then I'm going to put that in here and mix it. I'll add some spices to it. <laughs> uh, now, this might be too much rice, but I'm going to go a little... Well, not a little, but not all of it at once. And I think some of the spices I need are down in my bedroom. Down in your bedroom? Down the hallway into my bedroom. <laughs> He's got to be so specific. Well, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. I said, okay. you get, do you have a bath? Do you have a bedroom downstairs? No, but you know where my bedroom is. Uh -huh. So how can you get confused if I say down it's in my because, bedroom? I don't know. Maybe you have more than one bedroom. You would know. You would have had to move all the furniture. Mm -hmm. So, you know I don't have more than one bedroom. <laughs> but if you don't go get me the You got more spices, than one office. I've got like ten offices. I in know. <laughs> I was just trying to do some work out there on the couch watching a movie and... I am not coordinated enough. I don't know if I should do the rest of the meat. I can because it's not going to go to waste. I mean, we can eat just some rice. I mean, some meat. <laughs> some of the stuffing. Okay. I think. What do you think? I, I, you're in charge. You do as you want. <laughs> I would love to empty the trash. Well, go ahead. <laughs> I'm waiting for someone to offer to do it for me. Dog would love you if you drop something on the floor. I'm not going to drop anything on the floor for the dog. <laughs> well, he's checking to make sure anyway. That's fine. Can you go get me the spices? Yes, dear. Thank I'll go you. get the spice girls. Okay, so now that I rescued you by making good boats. Yes, you did. Thank you. Now what are you doing? I'm stuffing the boats and going to put them in the oven. Well, after I stuff them, I got to put a little bit of spaghetti sauce on it. And then I will put them in the oven. This one's a small one, but that's fine because mom eats small. <laughs> so um, then I'm going to put them in the oven. I could probably fit more onto there now that you've got them all 
Yeah, I don't know if we got any nice ones there or okay. if you could get, I can some, get more. some more. Out. Okay, hold on one second then. Let me kind of smush these in a little bit. Smush them. Smush them in a little smush bit. Smush them boats. So you don't have to even do this. What I'm doing here is squeezing them up to kind of make the cabbage cover the whole part. Uh -huh. But you can just leave them open. Like I I usually will just leave them open, but... It's because you gotta be different. Well, hey, <laughs> I don't know if other people even know about stuffed cabbage boats. <laughs> it's my creation. So if I want to do this with them, I can. <laughs> Anything hit the floor yet? Nope. No? I got a little something Keep on trying. the table over there. Which Keep trying. I need to clean up. I have a pro uh, cabbage right. peeler. Okay. Is that right? Yeah, anybody making stuffed cabbage or cabbage boats or anything that you need your cabbage peeled, I rent them out. That's right. It's mostly, For a fee. Mostly because I can't feel the end of my fingers. <laughs> and of course, it's on fire. <laughs> it's got a lava center. <laughs> These look like brains. It's good for Halloween, I suppose. We're having brains for dinner, guys. Brains. Okay, you could get me one, one or some... two more right there. One or two more. Okay, hold on. Instead, I can use one. Now you've got bloody brains. Yep, bloody brains. Bloody brains. Oh, we keep calling that. Mom's definitely not going to eat it. <laughs> Would you like some bloody brains? I know you would. You'll eat anything that hits the floor. Yes. And you're dangerous because and of that. Crafts. Stuff crafts. That makes her choke. Crafts and strings and yarn and whatever ever hits the floor. Okay, so there it is. I don't even know how many we got in there, but we got a lot. <laughs> Ovens are already preheating. Oh good, I'm glad you somebody thought of that. How much? I got it on 350. I need to check the time because I don't remember. But um, I want to clean all this up so we don't have a big mess for later to clean up. So maybe you can oh. help me with that. I thought you were going to say, right? maybe you can do that. Oh, maybe you can help me with that. <laughs> we can just throw it on the floor. Oh. Our vacuum cleaner will take care of it. Yeah, well, I don't want my vacuum cleaner to eat stuff that might make the vacuum cleaner sick. <laughs> so, oh, the answer to that is no. Oh. <laughs> we don't want a sick vacuum. <laughs> Do you have a problem? Is there a problem here? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So? Very yummy. Is it yummy? Mm -hmm. Well, thank you very much. I I'm put my heart and soul into it. I'm almost ready for a second serving. Mmm. <laughs> have you tasted yours? No, I just barely sat down. Well, you have to get back up again. Mm -hmm. No, uh You can get your own second. What do you think of it, Mom? It's okay. Good. If I get up, she's getting up, and then it's going to be all hell. Oh, never. Bye. Bye.